hello welcome in today's video i'm going to be trying lipstick and lip liners i'm going to be trying uh the lip liner and lipstick from anastasia beverly hills a set i'm going to be trying charlotte tilbury lipstick and lip liner and i'm going to be trying two red lipstick from mac and a lip liner from mac and i'm going to begin with the nude from anastasia beverly hills because it's i think it's going to be easier to remove it <laughs> and then try the red ones uh the anastasia beverly hill is this matte lipstick a uh, warm top shade and the um, lip liner is also warm top 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 i don't know how to pronounce it <laughs> warm top and this is how it looks like And let me show you the lipstick. It's the same shade. Um, ooh, it's so nice. <laughs> That's the shade. I'm not sure if this is new, but I just got it. <laughs> it's new to me. Mmm, I like it. Me gusta. I really like how this type of color looks on my lips. I think this looks better on my skin. It doesn't change uh, that much because it's warm. I think warm colors look better on my lips because they don't they don't turn that dark like the cool ones. Let me apply the lipstick and the lipstick is also new to me. Warm top. Wow. Look, it match perfectly. This set, I love it. It looks so nice. It combines perfectly both the lip liner and the lipstick. I really like it. Okay, now let's try the Charlotte Tilbury Kiss and Tail. <laughs> Kiss and Tail. I am not a professional for the records. This lip liner uh, is not that red. It's turning pink on me. I don't really like when a red lipstick or lip liner turns pink on my skin. <sighs> this is how the kiss and tail lip liner looks like. Yeah, I like this red kiss and tail, but it's not like they show it in the picture or here. It has like a pink, like a hot pink undertone, a pink with red. It's like a mix of red turning a little pink. 
Now let's apply the lipstick uh, coral kiss to see how it looks like. I'm not sure if this is still available, the coral kiss lipstick. I bought it like six months ago, but you know they are changing formulas all the time. I really like this combination of Coral Kiss and Kiss and Tail from Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I think it's good for a special occasion or any other occasion. It's not a red in my opinion. It has a like a pinkish undertone, but I like it. It's not, it doesn't look that bad. Um, I'm going to keep the lip liner, uh, even though it's not my favorite because it's um, not the type of red I was looking for, but I like it. I can combine it with other colors. Now I'm going to try these two uh, lipstick and the lip liner from MAC. Let's try this uh, Resort Season 992 with the lip liner red r-e-d-d -D. and i already tried this one previously before the video this lip liner and this is the type of lip liner that i like it doesn't turn pink on me it's red <laughs> i think it's true red in my opinion like the way i like I really like this color because it doesn't change. It stays red. It doesn't change to pink. This is the type of red I like. Between this MAC and the Charlotte Tilbury, I like the MAC one. The MAC If you want to buy the Charlotte Tilbury one, don't uh, let them deceive you. It looks red from here, but in reality is kind of pink when you apply it. And the MAC one is true red in my opinion. It doesn't change color. And it doesn't look red from here. It looks kind of brownish. I love it. I really like this MAC red. I really like it. This is my favorite now. Now let's try this uh, Powder Kiss Liquid Lip Color Resort Season Lipstick. This looks red in my opinion. Let's see if it doesn't turn on my lips. Liquid lip color or lip stain. Oh wow. I really like it. I'm not sure it match well with the lip liner, but I like it. I really, really do like it. I like this color. Um, this is the type of red that I like. Um, another thing that I like about this powdery lip color is that it doesn't transfer to my teeth. 
I think because it's powdery, so it doesn't transfer to my feet and it's now dry. It's dry, but at the same time, it's like soft and powdery. I really like it. Okay, now I'm going to try the Lock Kiss Ink. Gutsy 81. Uh, and this one is another lip color, uh, but this is no powdery. This is more liquidy and it looks orangey. This is the type of red that I like. So let's try and see how it looks on my lips with the same red R-E-D-D -D lip liner from MAC. Okay, this is the lip liner. Now let's apply the lip color. I like it. <laughs> I like how it looks. Oh, wow. This is a beautiful red. Wow. Wow, this is the perfect red that I like. Red, red, and it doesn't turn pink. Perfect. This one, I love it. I really, really love this red color is true red and now it's dry wow i really really like it because i think it's a true red if you are looking for a true red lipstick uh, you can try this Gutsy 81 from MAC and it doesn't transfer to your teeth. <laughs> it dries really quick and if you can add uh, some type of shine, you can do it on top. But since I want it to last long, I don't apply anything. But if you're looking for a true red, like I said, you can try this Gutsy 81 from MAC because it's really, really good. Any of these two, any of these two colors from MAC are long lasting. And I have tried many other red lipsticks from other brands and they turned pink on me. I gave up. <laughs> so I'm going to stick uh, I'm going to stick to this MAC Red Lipstick because I know these two don't change color on my lip. They stay red. They don't turn pink or fuchsia or purplish. Um, yeah, I like them. What do you think? And that's it for this video. My favorite lipstick are these two from MAC. And my favorite lip liner is also from MAC. And also I really, really like the lip liner and lipstick from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I am not so happy with the Charlotte Tilbury red um, lip liner because it's not true red in my opinion. It turns uh, pink, hot pink. <laughs> so it's not my favorite. The lip, the lipstick, I like it because I've been using it and I use it without lip liner when I don't wear makeup and I like it because it's, 
is not the red and is also no pink it's like coral so i like it and that's why i think this lipstick combines with this um uh kiss and tail lip liner because they are not completely red so this charlotte tilbury lip liner is a uh, kiss and tail is not my favorite but i'm going to keep it uh, i'm going to keep it because it's very long lasting it doesn't remove that easily and what else that's it for now i will see you in my next video